Hello everyone, my name is Iris Franz, Wu Jiao Wan Ru. Today we're going to talk about the second theorem of welfare economics. So bottom line first, the theorem tells you if all agents have convex preferences, then there always exists a set of price such that the Pareto efficient allocation is also a market equilibrium. So let's do a quick recap about efficiency. Efficiency means that we will not be able to improve Alice's welfare without hurting Bob's welfare. And now if all agents have convex preferences, that means an efficient allocation must be the tangent of the inference curve of Alice and the indifference curve of Bob. So these two indifference curves must be touch each other only once at point X. So X is an efficient allocation. And since we have this tangent point, we can also draw a straight line, a tangent line, a line that is tangent to this indifference curve of Alice and Bob. So we will call this the budget line. So once we have the budget line, we will have the price ratio. Because remember the budget line, we can calculate the slope of the budget line is equal to negative P1 over P2. And graphically, that will be delta x2 divided by delta x1. So that will be the amount of good 2 you're willing to give up in order to get one unit of good 1. So you can see after you manipulate this um, algebraically, you will see that P2 is equal to P1 times the reciprocal of your budget line. So any set of price that satisfies this equation is going to clear our market. So I hope this helps and I'll see you next time.